Hello and welcome to another daily Japanese booster pack opening. Made it through Monday. Congratulations. Another day down. Another day cl closer to the weekend. Beautiful. Let's see. Let's see what we get this week. Double check. Pretty sure my headset is good. Okay. Today we start off with <gasps> the Sneasel Rapid Strike. Oh, wow. And it's rapid striking the berries in the background. That's awesome. <laughs> That's cool. Then we got... Oh, my God. It's not... The name escapes me. Oh, my goodness. I can't think of it. Damn, we got my brain. Not pick pack, picky pack. It's <laughs> gosh darn it. That's okay. Uh, yes, it looks angry. Rightfully so. And a palpitoad. Nothing too exciting there in the comments to talk about. Okay. Oh, this one, the Palpito looks cool. Winky, winky kicking attack. <laughs> Alright. And the uncommon of the day. So, oh. Are you the seismitoad? Wow. What are the odds that we'd run into the Palpitoad and the seismitoad? And seismitoad is not in Chilling Rain, so I can't really get a good translation for this but let's take a look here 170 hp to stage two uh one energy for 60 damage yeah no i see something about um Running away, something about energy. I don't know. Can't make head to tell of that. But the uh, second attack, four energy and 160 damage. It's a lot of damage, but that's also a lot of energy. So, oh, revealed. Let it slip. My bad. So I don't know. I don't think it's all that good. It really depends on what that first attack, what the uh, the text is, but. Doesn't seem all that great. All right, and the final card. I think we all saw it's something shiny. Oh, I thought it was a double rare. Looks like it's a regular rare. Kind of, kind of rare is it? <gasps> it's another fighting type, and it's called Otosupas. <gasps> that sounds like. The grapple locked. It is. And we're all blurry. Come on. Oh, look at that. Crushing that tree. Ooh, it's got an ability. Tell me you are in chilling rain, please. You are. Okay. We can take a look at what it does. And we can see if it seems good. Just offhand. Ability is called... Stranglehold Master. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, your opponent's active Pokemon's retreat cost is two colorless energy more. Mm, kind of useful, but uh, after you knock it out, it seems a little less useful. And it's a uh, attack, three energy. Synchro Buster. If you have the same number of cards your hand is your opponent this attack is 80 more damage so uh very very <laughs> situational um it's good because it's a stage one easy to get to but uh other than that it seems a little too niche hard to get to um hard to activate and all that good stuff so mm, pretty meh but other than that it's a very nice looking card very fierce breaking that uh would be tree. Alright, let's get to the binder real quick. Let's see if we 
who we can get. Got ourselves a Sneasel, number 11. It's right there. Nice. No. <gasps> the Clobopus, which means the Grapplelock is going to be right here. And our Palpitoad is number 38. 938. It's right over here. Which means our Seismitoad is right next to it. And hey, we finished the Talon Flame. So you are see it's 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 gonna kill me. I don't know how it's not coming to me. But we finished the evolution line. Very nice. Talon flame. Beautiful. Alright, let's wrap this up before it gets too long. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had a lot of fun. See you back here tomorrow for another daily Japanese booster pack opening. Have yourself a terrific Tuesday. Stay safe out there and I will see you guys next time.